heard the doorbell ring. I have a pretty good idea what's at the door right now. Two big boxes. I wonder what these can be. Do me a favor right now. Leave me a like on this video. We're about to get ready to start unboxing these bad boys and I'll show you what's inside of them. I'm not exactly sure which box is which, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started cutting them. Oh, I just saw a peek. I may or may not be nursing a semi right now. Oh. Okay, so this is the uh, this is the other box. Can't tell. That right there is an X pipe. So those are the rest of the exhaust connections. If you catch my drift and you see where I'm going with that, let's get the next box opened. Here we go, we just put a light on for you guys. And I just stabbed my finger with a staple, but that's okay. <laughs> Woo! That's one. That makes number two. That's right, we have already picked up some long tube headers. They're from TPS Motorsports. They are made, manufactured in USA. They are one and seven eighths inch, all the way to the three inch collector. Full stainless steel. We also have the rest of the stainless steel piping. We have an off-road X-pipe. And the following connections, I don't really know what those go to. But we have several other goodies in here as well, too, which I will also go over. All right, I went ahead and laid all of the exhaust components out for you. The headers, we got the gaskets, we have the stage eight locking bolts, titanium wrap, the ignition coil covers to keep the heat out. We also have a catch can. We have the various other clamps. And then we have the X-Pipe followed by the connectors to my NPP dual mode exhaust. I am so excited to have the headers here. As you know, I kept making comments about how quiet the Grand Sport currently is because it is, it's just so quiet. I even have the, I even have the fuse unplugged from the NPP exhaust. But this, this off-road X pipe, the long tubes, that will all fix the issues of my Grand Sport being very quiet. And I cannot wait to get this all installed. Now, before you have a couple of questions for me in the comments, I know you're gonna be asking when I'm gonna get these headers installed onto the car. Now, unfortunately, I am leaving tonight. I have a wedding to go to. I have a vacation to go on. It's gonna be almost a week long, and then I have another wedding to go to after that, and then I have a third wedding to go to after that. So I am booked out. I am going to try my best to get these on the car very soon. I haven't determined whether I am gonna put the headers on myself or if I'm gonna pay a shop to do it. I am gonna call around and get a couple quotes. Um, preferably I would want a shop that could dyno tune the car while it's there as well. And then also get, you know, like a baseline for me. As you know, headers are not the most simple install. Uh, my car being a Grand Sport with the dry sump oil system is going to make it even harder to install because you're gonna have all those external oil pump lines in the way while you're doing the head stall. The head stall? The header install. But rest assured, we'll have these parts on the car very soon. Probably do my own wrap job on these headers as well. I'm gonna show you how to wrap your headers with some titanium wrap. I think that would be really cool. I think a lot of you will like to see that. Let me know in the comments below if you do wanna see that. But I think we're gonna end that video here. I hope you guys are excited to hear how this thing is going to sound with the headers on the car with the Catless X-Pipe. It should be nearly full loud. We are keeping the NPP axle back because I really do like the sound of that axle back. Um, if it's still not loud enough for me, maybe we will do another axle back for the car. But once again, if you're watching to the end, thank you, I appreciate you. Make sure you leave a like on this video and subscribe to follow the build because we are still very, very early in the process of building this car. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. I'll catch you later.